If they're a narcissist, why did you stay if they were that bad? It's called conditioning. Victims are conditioned in their dynamics with a narcissist. Victims are blamed for why a narcissist acts the way they do or reacts the way they do. If a victim unintentionally caused narcissistic injury, narcissistic injury is a bruise to the narcissist's ego because their insecurities have been triggered. A narcissist depends on deflection. Deflection means taking no accountability for your actions, so you blame it on the next individual. In this case, the victim is blamed for why the narcissist acted the way they did. If they got angry, if they committed infidelity, or even if they put their hands on the victim, it was always the victim's fault. The victim is led to believe that when the narcissist does something that the narcissist knows is wrong because the victim was conditioned to believe that their wrongdoings, their hurtful acts are due to the victim, that is their punishment. So the victim tries to avoid that type of attacking or avoid that type of behavior by trying to stay on the narcissist's good side. Why do they stay though? A lot of people ask that question. Simply put, the victim not only feels that they are the problem, they are the reason why the narcissist acts the way they do, but they hold on to some of the good sides of the narcissist. Monday, they're acting mean, hurtful, and they are criticizing the victim. Tuesday, it's I love you, you're my one and only, you're my soulmate, we belong together, I'm sorry. Wednesday, they're lashing, they're raging, they're hurting the victim, they're hurting the victim's feelings. Thursday, they're coming home with flowers, candies, chocolates, hearts, all that good stuff. I'm sorry, I love you. Friday, they're acting up, picking fights, raging, insulting the victim. Saturday, they're kissing the forehead. I love you. You're my everything. You're my one and only. Let's be together forever. Sunday, same bullshit. It's back and forth. It's reward and punishment behavior because if the victim is compliant with the narcissist, they get the good side. If they're not too compliant with the narcissist, they get the bad side. That is called conditioning. Unfortunately, many people suffer this. Many people can fall for this. And this is pretty much why a lot of victims find it very hard to leave a narcissistic individual.